Hi, this is Melissa Heavener and this is another episode of Psychic in Your Pocket. It's in the evening and a lot of people ask me what are some of the things that I do to help me stay on my spiritual path. Now, a lot of the cleanses are really popular right now. And this isn't exactly a cleanse, but this is actually a combination of liquids that I got in meditation that are very helpful for spiritual health as well as physical health. If you have an issue with sugar, you need just a very little bit of two of the juices that are included here and more of the water. But this is the combination that I have. And the juices are prune juice, which is really good for the solar plexus. Um, you want to get the best kind that you can, organic if possible, and not but from concentrate if possible. And you just need a fourth of it. As I said, it's really good for the solar plexus and the digestive system. I actually cannot stand the taste of prune juice, so I put cranberry juice in it to kind of combat the taste of the prune juice. Um, but cranberry juice is also good for the root chakra. And the kind that I use is this right here. And again, you want organic if possible with no sugar added. And I put more cranberry juice than prune juice because ugh, I don't like the taste of prune juice. But you can put as little or as much as you want to taste. But this is really good for the root chakra. It's also good for the circulatory system, which helps balance all the chakras. And then the final ingredient is holy water. This is actually Kabbalah water. Um, it's considered holy water. It's blessed by the rabbis. They pray over it. Um, the rabbis that have been practicing Kabbalah the longest, and they put a positive intention to help purify the body and put you back to your highest vibration or the body back to its highest vibration. If you don't um, have access to a Kabbalah center, you can just use purified water. But of course, I love to use the water with the highest vibration because of the intentions that the rabbis put in it. And I usually put about this much of the holy water in it, a, a, a fourth. But again, if you have issues with sugar, you can put more water in it to dilute it and basically fix it to taste. But water also helps to purify the chakras, purify the body, and it strengthens the crown chakra because it's translucent or clear in color. Um, as with anything, you don't want to overdo it, but I try to have this drink at least a little bit, um, an eight, eight ounce of it, of this combination at least once a day. Um, if you can't do it that often, twice a week would be great. And again, the more water, the more diluted, but this combination is great for the chakras, both spiritual energy, body, and the physical body. So I hope this has been helpful, and until next time, love, light, and blessings. Bye!